Welcome back to Definitely Not Definitive. I'm Ken. And I'm Bethany. And we're just a couple of kooky crazy kids in love that love doing some rap battle reactions. Hell yeah, we do. Yes, we do. And we've done some other ones before. Uh, we started a new channel. We have our uh, other channel it does mainly video games and uh, video game trailers. And we do some gameplay on there for Halloween. Yeah. We're going to do a bunch of Halloween themed things. This is Jack the Ripper versus Hannibal Lecter rap battle. And uh, Bethany's a big Jack the Ripper fan, so she might be a little bit biased as far as who's going to win. I don't know if we're going to say fan. Is fan the right word yeah, when you're talking fan. about a serial killer? That just makes <laughs> me sound crazy. I don't, I don't know if I'd go fan. Fan's a very strong word for a serial you're, killer. You're, you're, you're very interested in Jack the Ripper. I'm you're, fascinated. You're fascinated by Jack the Ripper. That, yeah. that's, that's a better word. She's a fan. <laughs> <laughs> so let's go ahead. Okay, so the way we do these rap battles is uh, we watched it one time, just you know, purely for entertainment purposes, and then the second time we're gonna go ahead and like score each round and say who we thought won. Okay. Um, you know, it's not super scientific or anything. It's totally scientific. <laughs> It's Jack the Ripper, Jack the Rapper Following you way before the dawn of Twitter I'm a human trigger warning through the night until the morning When the light shines upon my crime You find it sick, appalling and infamous Notorious, delinquent There's little more gory a thing than Living in Victorian England This is horrorcore Beware if you're a common whore Or at late night you may find me knocking on your door Not keen to leave until I'm knee deep in blood and gore You grieving family on their knees We've been scrubbing floors If the police need a lead They know what they're looking for My rap's are like the way I eat my meat, bloody war. Yeah, you're a classic megalomania. You haven't mentioned me once in your entire battle rap. Pity our verse wasn't worth a trip in the jack. We're jacking off in the track and put the lotion in the back. Yes! Serial killer can deliver. Rhymes finer than the county. I would pair with your liver. The start of your putrid flesh makes me want to shiver. Cause your British body's covered in more piss than kitty litter. You stabbed women when they wouldn't give you attention. Like a petty dreadful version of OJ Simpson. <laughs> even known and you didn't even come up with that shit on your own i'm real you'll find me making vacancies in brothels uh. while you only exist inside the pages of a novel you were kept for ages in the hovel uh. contained within a cage behind a locked door while well, i never got caught yeah. so who's the superior serial killer dr lecture i'm still wanted you're forgotten people these days are watching death stars uh. so uh. protect you from the hell i've spread upon us i'm terrorizing london fuck the seven seven bombers no Damn. Damn. jack you are doing fine for your ham-fisted attempt at a Terrorist lie. How typical of Jack the Ripper to chase a headline. Pick where Leota's brain. Ask him how I get mine. I'm the boom wave from the violence. A licensed psychiatrist two times in higher society to the sound of violence. Don't get me wrong. I gross both your balls and I have a serial killer. You're as tasteless as a bowl of kashi. You pray on a prostitute and play with her body. I don't mind that you're naughty, Jack. I hate that you're sloppy. Mm. Barney, take me back to solitary confinement. Cause this dirty little lamb has just been silenced. Oh! Go back All to right. the beginning. Uh, so that was good. It was, a, it was a quicker one than than some of the other ones we've seen. Uh, we'll go. I think maybe one of the ones we saw that was the longest was like the Joker and Pennywise one. That seemed mm. to be the longest one so far. All right. Ready? Ready. Okay. Jack the Ripper. The liquor is Jack the Ripper, Jack the Rapper. Following you way before the dawn of Twitter. I'm a human trigger warning through the night until the morning. When the light shines upon my crime, you find it sick, appalling, and infamous, notorious, delinquent. There's little more gory a thing than living in Victorian England. This is horrorcore. Beware if you're a common whore. Or at late night, you may find me knocking on your door. Not keen to leave until I'm knee deep in blood and gore. You grieving family on their knees, we've been scrubbing floors. If the police need a lead, they know what they're looking for. My raps are like the way I eat my meat. Bloody war. Yeah, you're a classic megalomania. You haven't mentioned me once in your entire battle rap. Pity our verse wasn't worth a trip in the jack. We're jacking off in the track and put the lotion in the bass. And catch what the ill oh, serial best. killer can deliver. Rhymes finer than the county I would air with your liver. Cause the start of your putrid flesh makes me want to shiver. Cause your British body's covered in more piss than kitty litter. You stabbed women when they wouldn't give you attention. Like a petty dreadful version of OJ Simpson. 
accepts that But these days your nickname is all that's even known And you didn't even come up with that shit on your own I'm all right, who'd you think won? Lecter. Yeah, he Hands crushed. He, he demolished Jack the Ripper in that one. Yeah. Uh, I think I don't think Jack the Ripper really got his uh, rhymes going until that horrorcore line. Yeah. Then his raps, like you know, the I, I feel like the lyrically that they were better and like the flow of it was was kind of better. Hannibal Lecter, like right from the get go, just seemed to have yeah. it. Yeah. Well, and one thing I was thinking of after the first time we we watched it is I was like it. The way that they rap, I mean, this is going to be like a callback to Hamilton, one of my favorite musicals, one of everybody's favorite musicals, um, <laughs> is it was very interesting to me how the raps seemed to fit the character. Like, okay. Hannibal Lecter's from the start for me were just smarter. They yeah. were, they were, they had finesse. I mean, they were just, they were a high class, like a high class rap because he just yeah. did it with such skill. Um, Jack the Ripper is a little bit messy. And is a little bit disjointed at first. Mm -hmm. He takes a minute to find his rhythm, which kind of matches his crimes as well. Um, and also, there's some debate as to who Jack the Ripper was and really was he intelligent. So I think the approach on this was like so genius by the creators because to me it was like it, it described the essence of the character so well, just in the way that they rap. And was Jack the Ripper a Jack? Or maybe it was a Jill the Ripper? <laughs> I explored the idea that maybe it was a woman at one point. That's yeah. why he's throwing that in there. Okay, let's see if uh, Jack the Ripper can rebound from that. Let's see. Real. You'll find me making vacancies in brothels uh. While you only exist inside the pages of a novel You were kept for ages in the hovel uh. Contained within a cage behind a locked door While well, I never got caught yeah. So who's the superior serial killer, Dr. Lecter? I'm still wanted, you're forgotten People these days are watching death stops I've got protection from the hell I've spread upon us I'm terrorizing London, fuck the 7-7 seven, seven bombers No, yeah. no, Jack, you are doing fine Before your ham-fisted attempt at a terrorist line How typical of Jack the Ripper to chase a headline Pick where Leota's brain and ask him how I get mine I'm the boom bay boom to violence A licensed psychiatrist Two times in highest society To the sound oh. of violence Don't get me wrong I gross both your balls and my hibachi But for a serial killer You're as tasteless as a bowl of kashi You pray on a prostitute And play with her body I don't mind that you're naughty Jack I hate that you're sloppy Barney, take me back to solitary confinement Cause this dirty little lamb Has just been silenced Oh, yeah! Again, I think it's I think I think it's a sweep. I think it's that hundred percent Lecter. Yeah, uh, Hannibal Lecter won both. Uh, once again, Jack the Ripper's lines just seemed a little dis disjointed. I think it, it almost had the same. It, it, it in a way it matched the the same way his first rap was, where like he didn't really get its, into its flow until towards the end there. Yeah. So uh, like you said, I guess that's a stylistic choice. Um, I just didn't like it. <laughs> <laughs> I I think that Lecter took it hands down again. And one thing that I thought was interesting was. The line about him only being in a novel. Yeah, from Jack the Ripper, yeah. Because actually, the character of Hannibal Lecter was written by a guy based on a real person. Obviously, his name wasn't Hannibal Lecter. Yeah. He took some some fictional license with his story, of course. Um, but it's not like Hannibal Lecter was just pulled out of nowhere. Like There was mm -hmm. an actual real person basis for this character that I think evolved into something really chilling but it came from somewhere that was that was evil to start and yeah the different shots of Hannibal Lecter like with like blood all over his mouth that they kind of just like threw in there I kind of liked but overall I would say that I liked the portrayal of Jack the Ripper better like I didn't like his raps better mm -hmm. but I like the portrayal of Jack the Ripper better than I like the portrayal of Hannibal Lecter I I liked it all <laughs> you, uh, you liked it I, I thought the actor who, who did Hannibal Lecter I thought he crushed it like to me it was like Somebody who who really embodied Hannibal Lecter right down to like a sort of edge in the voice and a, and a pattern of speech that that was obviously reminiscent of Anthony Hopkins portrayal compared to somebody who was kind of like the cartoon costume version of Jack the Ripper, which is not to knock that guy. Yep. He has a lot less to draw from. I mean, it's very easy when you have someone in a performance where like there's a roadmap right to it. Yeah. Um, so it, this is not knack, like not knocking the skills of the actors at all. But for me, it was just like, you could see how the Hannibal Lecter actor just, he had so much material to draw from to create this. I mean, I thought that the bloody mouth was a creepy touch and it certainly like those flashes mm -hmm. added to the craziness, but he was chilling enough on his own for me that I was like, you didn't need it. I don't think it took away from it, but like the actor doing Hannibal Lecter for me, I was just like, oh, he's like, he's in it. 
Well, I think between the debate of this battle, uh, you crushed it as well. I, I just got demolished <laughs> in this one. You had so much better insight than me. Uh, I'll, try to, I'll try to do better next time and, and really bring it. Uh, let us know down in the comments who you thought won and uh, some of your favorite lines from this one and uh, you know what really, what really won it for you, whose performance you like better. And uh, more suggestions for which rap battle we should react to next. Yes, um, yeah, we want to keep it coming, you know. And just keep in mind that our reaction to Jack the Ripper versus Hannibal Lecter, epic rap battles of history, is definitely not definitive.